Eagles cornerback Byron Maxwell. Byron, glad to have you with us here on NFL Total Access. We're going to talk Eagles here uh, in just a little bit, but I want to start uh, with a place I know you hold very dear to your heart there in Charleston, South Carolina, and uh, in, in the tragic events of, of last week, uh, really kind of striking us all with those feelings of outrage and sadness. And I know for you, being from the Charleston area, uh, that those, uh, those feelings probably especially difficult, so much so that you went back uh, to the area in the wake of the tragedy there. What did you see in Charleston, and what's the message you came back with? Uh, really, what I saw in Charleston was just love at a, a tragic event. Um, everybody from that community pulled together. We had, we had people coming from different, different communities pulling together, um, showing the world love. They had a, a, a bridge walk for peace. Right after that, so I mean, what I saw, if anything, you know, coming from Charleston is, is love, and I'm really proud of my city, um, standing up, showing the world that. And is that what you kind of grew up with? That that mentality that you went back and saw in the wake of these events is that some of the things that you grew up with there in Charleston, that attitude of love. I mean, I, that's that, I think that's yeah. I mean, as far as like my family, they, they they always put that in me. You know, they always put love. Uh, just being humble, treating, treating uh, people like how you want to be treated. So um, that's the only thing I saw from, yeah. uh, from Charleston and, and, and my city and my family. And Byron, uh, your, uh, the event that you hold to benefit uh, your charity, uh, the Bowling with the Stars event held there in South Carolina, in Charleston, uh, how, how's that, that event uh, a little different now this year? Um, you know, we, whatever the proceeds we, we get from there, we're going to give to... Uh, the victims of the family that happened with this tragic event in Charleston. So we're just trying to uh, affect the community, uh, bring positive energy to the community. Um, so, you know, June 27th, if you could come out, man, we would really appreciate it. Um, have a good time with us. Uh, really great to see you taking advantage of the platform <clears throat> that being a professional football player really allows and a professional career now that has taken you to Philadelphia.